Yeah, it's very exciting. It's um, something that you sort of aim for personally, but once you achieve it, um, it's very special. And I guess you, you look at the squad and see the guys who have been picked. Um, and the fact that it's against the Poms over in England, it's something that I'm really looking forward to and it's very exciting to be involved with. It's, um, it was fantastic to be able to win the Shield with Queensland and I guess this is a topping, uh, the topping icing on the cake. But uh, in saying that, there's a lot of hard work now to be done and um, it sort of fits in well leading into the next season as well domestically. To be honest, I never really thought about it. It was, um, I, I guess our focus was so um, intense with trying to win the Shield with Queensland. It was such a massive goal that um, it was only until the end of the season that we sort of sat down and um, started to think about things personally that um, I thought it might have been a chance. But like I said, to get the, the final word today, it's um, something I'm very excited about and very much looking forward to. I've uh, been over twice for some league cricket um, and the second year I went I played a bit of Sussex second eleven, so the county second eleven stuff. So. Um, I've had a bit of experience, probably not too much first class experience, which is um, probably something that I'm looking forward to working on over the, the weeks leading up to the tour. So, um, yeah, so that's something I can work on at the academy. Yeah, definitely. Um, I think you, you just look at the names in the in the squad that's going, going over to the UK and it just speaks for itself. It's um, very exciting, um, like I said earlier, to be able to play against the Poms as well and on such a big tour it's um, something I'm very much looking forward to. Um, I hope so, uh, I think I'm just trying to learn as much as possible, get as much volume in as possible and um, try and become a better batter with every game I play and every training session. I think um, that's all you can do and you know, it, it, when you go out and play you've got to trust the, your instincts from training and it's um, something that yeah, I'm always trying to improve on as a batsman. Yeah, it's fantastic. It's um, something I still look back at on now, and it's just the excitement of the, the day still still burns through. So um, it, it's easy to use that as motivation as well in pre-season. You can sort of get up early in the morning and go, go for those sessions. So it's um, something I'm always looking back on. I've been doing quite a bit of fitness and um, just trying to get the volume back in my batting. Um, just so when I do go to the academy in two weeks, so I can hit the ground running and try and improve and prepare as best I can for this um, Australia A tour. Well, obviously my, my friends and family, um, first and foremost, just for getting me involved with cricket and I guess giving me the opportunity to play the, the sport that I love. Um, then I, I guess the Queensland support staff and uh, Darren Lehman as coach, it's, we've got a fantastic staff here with all our coaches and our, our leadership group in particular is um, really fantastic. It makes a a really good environment to sort of improve and to perform. So it's something I'm very much thankful for.